What's up guys welcome to our first tutorial on HTML. Today we will cover very basics of HTML. To start with you can use any text editor like notepad++ or notepad. Defining the type of your web page should be the very first thing in your document. We can write it as top type HTML which specifies that this is an HTML5 type of document. It is not a tag but an instruction to the browser about the version of HTML the page is written in. What describes your HTML page is the HTML opening and closing tag. In that, body tag describes the visible page content. For example, we print hello world. To save this document and save it with an extension of HTML. To open an HTML page, we will simply navigate to the folder where the file is saved and run it. This is how the content is being printed. There are 6 versions of he heading tag from h1 to h6. We can write it as hello world. Now we can just check how the h1 tag is being printed. Likewise, to make our work easier, I would simply copy paste this and make it as h2 h2 tag h3 h4 h5 and h6 to see the output these are the 6 versions of heading tag that we can see from h1 to h6. The next we will describe is a paragraph. For example, I write a text. This is a paragraph. And save it to the file and simply run it to see what output it gives. This is how it will be printed. Now just to extend it, I will simply repeat what I have written over here multiple number of times to check what outcome it gives. Now this paragraph tag is window dependent. It would be dif uh, displayed different when we resize. And there is another thing to note is the browser adds an empty space before and after a paragraph. If I define three paragraphs this way, it gives an output with an empty line above and below the defined paragraph. Another important thing about paragraphs are any number of spaces which are defined in between it will be treated as only a single space and also it goes with a new line any number of new line that I add in a paragraph is treated as a single space. In order to display a text in a paragraph on a different line, we use line break tag which is written as br and we can just make it the way it was 
and to see the output we'll just refresh the page now that you can see after the first second third fourth text a be a, a line break was described which results in the text after the line break being shown on the next line now we will check out few of the formatting elements like i again write a text in a paragraph tag note that html is not a case sensitive language now we define few formatting elements like i write in a paragraph i can see some bold text in this paragraph and uh, i define this bold text with p element and i see the outcome i can see bold text in this paragraph likewise i write it as some strong text in this paragraph and define this p as strong strong is just an added semantic with strong importance now we write it as italics and another type we can define it as em emphasized which is just to see the outcome this is how it shows we can also describe few text as subscript or superscript like like we can define some subscript and superscript text i can see some subscript text subscript is subscript is defined by sub and this is what the outcome it will show likewise superscript goes by sup i'm just simply copy pasting the content thanks for watching our tutorial for any doubt query or request you can always write us to vidhacomputerguys@gmail.com thank you see you soon